Well, it's a truly unusual sight. You may remember this swirling disk of ice up in Maine from a couple weeks ago. And this is sped up video, of course, right here. As a local researcher has set up a webcam pointed at the disk and is now studying it intently. Meteorologist TJ Del Santo joins us now with what he's learned. New at 530. It became an internet sensation, and now this rotating disk of ice will help researchers better understand the Arctic climate. It's still rotating, it's rotating. It's mesmerizing. The whirling wheel of ice in the Presumpscot River in Westbrook, Maine, is somewhat rare. An ice disk that's 100 yards across is not that typical. Chris Norvat, a researcher at Brown University, had his Arctic sea ice research halted by the government shutdown. While he had some extra time on his hands, he decided to set up a webcam aimed at the main ice. And it's a lot easier to get to than the Arctic. Here was a piece of ice that was in the, you know, in a place that we could access. We could put a camera on top of a building, look at it, and then process the, the imagery afterwards. Studying this ice disk can help researchers understand what happens in the Arctic. By understanding how these individual pieces change and how they affect you know, the amount of heat that goes into the ocean and the warming of the planet, we can get a good picture for how the Arctic climate system will continue to change. The river ice grew and the disk stopped spinning, but Norvat is excited to see what will come next. Yeah, I think we're really excited to find out what happens to this, this piece of ice. Not only because I'm interested in this from an Arctic perspective, but it's also just a cool thing. We've included a link to the webcam and included other video of the spinning disk of ice on our website at WPRI.com. I'm TJ Del Santo, Eyewitness News.